Okay guys, we are back and it's a I'm, I'm waiting for one person to say flip. Flip and it's not a flop. Good job you guys. It's not a fallopian tube? I In the chat said, where are her legs? <laughs> um, sorry, they're right here. All right, you guys, we are back at the shack. You already know what's up. So we are in the middle of a flip. And guys, today, I think we're gonna finish it. Let's go to the house. Okay, so to give you guys a quick refresher, this is, wow. <laughs> Wow, this place is even more gorgeous than I remember, seriously. This is what we have so far. We did the whole downstairs. Uh, this is our pretty pink paradise, including the bathroom. Oh my God, what the hell? This place is literally gorgeous and I look even more gorgeous in the mirror. So all we have left to do is the upstairs up here, which I already kind of started a little bit. And we also have this extra room across the street, which we have not done anything to yet, as you can tell. But I have been looking in the comments of the last video on my YouTube channel, and you guys gave a lot of really, really good suggestions for what we should do with the upstairs and what we should do with this room over here. I love when you comment on my videos. If you comment on my videos, that just says to me, you're like just the best. Like you're giving me so much love and support. So I'm gonna give you love and support by giving you a little shout out. So Christina said, I say knock the upstairs walls down, put a banister around the stairs and turn it into a super cute loft bedroom, which honestly, I love that idea so much because I feel like this room and this room, like the shape of these two rooms are both like very odd. So imagine if we just knocked the walls down and made it into a loft. It would give us a lot of space and I think it would just be really, really cute. So I think that's what we're gonna do up here. And then Honey Blossom said that we should change the separate room into a sauna. Because if you guys remember from our last flip, Literally all of the buyers wanted a sauna, you guys. Everyone wanted a sauna for some reason. And this is kind of like the perfect size to just put a little sauna in here. And it's, it's what they all want, you know? Let's give them what they want and hopefully they will give us a lot of money, okay? That's the, that's the plan. Let's start by knocking on these walls, you guys. Um, I forget how to play this game. Let's do a little demolition right now. We are knocking these walls down now. Oh my God, there is just nothing like destroying a wall, you guys. This is just giving me so much serotonin right now. The sound of the wall shattering is like really doing something for me. Someone asked, are we wearing goggles? Um, I don't think so. so don't, don't try this at home. This doesn't even make any sense. Like, how is this part of the wall still standing? For real? For real, I just wanna know. Someone give me one real explanation for, for why this is like this. Uh, cause it's a video game is my answer. Okay, I feel like we should leave this closet here. Um, just because we're not really gonna get like much from knocking down this wall like, and having this little space. And every bedroom needs a closet, you know, to put their clothes away or hide their skeletons or whatever. Oh my God, there's like bricks like hitting me in the head. Like this is just falling right on top of me. Um. What? How is... 
Okay. <gasps> oh my god, new skill point unlocked, you guys. Let's cash this in right now. Should we get Passionate Hammer Master? <laughs> Please, Passionate Hammer Master? I like the sound of that. I mean, Passionate Hammer Master, like, we just have to. Okay, so I think I got all, well, we have to get rid of this. But other than that, we got all the walls down. And honestly, this is looking really nice so far. It's gonna look really good when we add the little fence or whatever. So let's sell this. Let's sell this. And let's fill in this part of the floor. Perfect. Now we just need the wallpaper here and here. Well, actually, I guess we're gonna do this all one color now. Woo! Oh my God, I'm crazy. We should just leave it like this. Woohoo! What do you guys think? Should we do the whole upstairs this pink paint color or should we do the whole upstairs this flower wallpaper? Let me know right now. I'm only gonna take the opinion of a few of you who answered the quickest. Paint, okay. Okay, perfect. Now everyone sit back, relax, and enjoy the beautiful and calming sounds of the paint roller. Wow. Sounds like wet, what? Wow. Okay, this looks great. What's inside here? Did we do this? Okay, yeah, we did pink in here. Perfect. Literally perfect, gorgeous, beautiful. Oh my God, it looks even better when just the, the light from the neon signs is, is providing us with all of the light in the room. Wow. All right, we've got to figure out uh, something for this balcony, whatever. Let's look. Where even would be like fence? Do they, do I even have this? Like, oh, banister. Oh. Railing. Ooh. Rail, rail. Railroad tracks? Oh no. It's just crazy. I feel like our gigantic big brain for interior design is just so big and gigantic that we're thinking of concepts for this house that are so incredible that they don't even have the tools to provide us with to be able to accomplish our ideas. Okay, what if, oh my God, I have an idea. What if we built a wall and then we just knock the top half down? There we go. <laughs> the buyers are gonna be like, this room is not finished. Look, there we go. Okay, it could be the style, you guys. Like, let's just envision it. Demo demolition chic. Yes. Demo <laughs> demolition chic. Yeah, this is just ugly and fugly. Like, I'll be honest. Oh, I just don't know what to do because it was such a good idea to make this upstairs into a loft. Get these bricks out of here. Get out of here. Should we, just, should we just do the glass wall? I mean, it's not the worst thing. Okay, I mean, it's really ugly. <laughs> I say... Hmm. Should we just burn the whole place down? You know what? This doesn't look awful, but it doesn't look amazing. It's not bad. It's not bad for like what we're working with. I feel like also if we put a plant here or like something here, it will look even better. A Swiss cheese plant. Oh, with a pink pot, you guys. <gasps> yes. 
Why can't I put it right in the corner? We need like, this is why we should be playing The Sims instead. So we can put on move objects. Like, why can't I put it there? This is the closest I can put it. What the heck, you guys? I was just about to get all my potheads to rise up in the chat. But, oh, maybe we do like a tall one like this with less leaves coming out of the side. It'll fit here. Okay. Okay, that's not bad. It's actually not bad. All right, let's sell this rug. I think it's a little too small. Okay. Look how tall this plant is. It's, it's taller than me. I'm looking up at it. People hate it. People hate it. Wow. Keep in mind, like, every single thing in this game is ugly. Oh, we could try this. Okay, here's another option. Option two. We could do a cactus, I think, might work. Okay, here's option three. Cactus. Okay, I think three is the best out of these options. So let's sell these two. Let's look for a bed. Okay, we need a nice, pretty, pretty pink bed, you guys. There's not a lot of space up here. <laughs> yikes. Yikes. I mean, we could put the bed over here. Yikesy, yikes, yikes. Aw, should we get this? Aw, should we get this bed? Aw. Hey, this is so cute and perfect. How cute and perfect is this? Too bad it's ginormous. Ooh, what about this one? Because you could put it away when you're done using it. It's giving coffin. You know what? I don't have to sleep in it. Can you actually close it when you're done using it though? Oh my God, you can. <laughs> I mean, that's kind of a good solution. And look, people are saying, ugh. Now I can sleep peacefully. So I think they're liking it actually. When you get out of bed and walk into a cactus, that's actually goals. Okay, I think we should put it here. Hello, get in the right spot. There. Okay, I mean. <laughs> okay. I mean, I think this is the best location for it if we go with this bed right like this is fine this is fine our only other option would be if we wanted to do like a single bed instead because honestly a single bed would solve a lot of our problems we could just put like this single bed like over here and this could be like a bachelor pad you know but this is the stiffest bed i've ever seen in my life like there's no way that's actually a bed everyone in the the chat saying that's a couch not a bed well explain this Single bed mantis. Bed. This is a bed, you guys. Don't get it twisted, okay? Oh my god, too bad everything is ugly. I mean, this is what would go the best, I feel like, with the colors up here. We could put this over here. Wait, why, why is this game like this? Why is this game like this, you guys? I can't put this up against the wall because of this... Because of the blanket? You've gotta be kidding me. Oh, how frustrating is this? Seriously, how frustrating is this? <gasps> Where'd the bed go? Great, no bedroom. You've gotta be kidding me. That's what they said. I did not get rid of the bed. That was not my choosing. Okay, hold on. Let me try something here. Just, tr just trust me. Just trust me. All right, let me try putting the window on this side. Okay. Slay. So now there's a window up here, which is nice. Wait, what happened? Hello? Is that my chill sign? What happened? Now we can put the bed back over here and I feel like it'll look more normal because the window was like off-centered back here and it's like indented into the wall. I mean, it's gonna be ugly up here. Like, I don't know what to tell you. Like we're working with the ugliest stuff ever. No access to the closet. As if we can't just do this, check this out. And here we go, I'm accessing the closet right now, you guys. I'm accessing it right now. There we go. Okay, these are our bed options. These are the only beds that will fit up here in the corner. So you guys have to vote, okay? Oh, we need to get our chill sign because it fell. 
We cannot forget about this. Maybe that would be a good thing to put above the bed because you're chilling, you know, when you're in bed, you're chilling. Yes, <laughs> yes. So the chat has voted for bed number two. I have to say your guys' choice, like it's looking a little stiff, okay? It's looking a little stiff, I'll be honest, but at least it can go all the way up against the wall, okay? And then it's solving your problem. Should we put a side table? Oh, this is definitely what I was talking about. Stylized lamp. Oh, we could get a pink shade here. Okay, this could be good. Perfect. And let's add like a little plant or something. I love I love adding a little a little touch of green throughout the house, you know? Oh, okay, how cute. Okay, we definitely need some type of like art or something on the walls. I mean, we could put, <laughs> we could put our chill sign over here, but I feel like, wait, maybe with the side table it'll look better. Okay, we could put it like that. We could move this maybe. <laughs> oh my God. <gasps> wow. It's, it's actually looking pretty chill over here. Can you put a body in the closet? I will be doing that towards the end. I think we need a rug underneath the bed. Like when you get out of bed, you're, you want your feet to hit a, a rug, you know? You don't want to hit the cold hardwood floor. So let's see what we're working with here. Ooh, I'm liking this color pink. Okay, we need to add maybe some office space over here. Maybe like a little place to sit. Just some other things in the bedroom. Let's add like a little heart-shaped vanity. This is so cute. <gasps> How cute is this? And look, it goes so well with our, our heart-patterned wall. This is so cute. Okay, I don't know where I'm gonna put it quite yet, but I just wanna, I just wanna put it down. Ooh, we need a little seat for it. I'm liking this, this is cute. Should we add a poof at the end of the bed? That's kind of cute. Let me use this poof. Oh, we need TVs on the walls. That is so true. I forgot the buyers like keep saying they want a TV in the bedroom. Probably because there's no TV down here either. Where the hell are we gonna put the TV? Let me center this on the wall. This is a really important part of the room. Okay, let's see how this looks over here. Oh, wow, wait, we really could keep an eye out for Selena if we put it here. <gasps> Someone just said, what a clean home. I just wanna let you guys know. It rose to the top of the charts and they said, what a clean home. We could put it on the, the banister. <laughs> Imagine you're like walking up the stairs and there's an earthquake and the TV falls on you and hits you in the head. Okay, which poof do you guys like the best? Okay, white it is. White it is. We could put a wall TV over here and make like a little hangout section. Oh, she's sweet but a psycho, a little bit psycho. Wait, let's turn it on for ambiance. Yes. Hmm, what else could we add? Okay, okay. Okay, okay, it's not bad. Something like this. Relax. It always looks better with the lights off. Wait, I have an idea, hold on. Look, it just makes sense, okay? Relax in bed, chill in your bean bags. <laughs> and then we can get rid of this one. This one's really big. All right, I'm not done yet. Let me keep, let me keep cooking, okay? This house is too good. You should keep it and sell the shack. <gasps> Make across the street your office. Oh my God. Do you think I should do that? Damn. I am getting emotionally attached to this house. I'm not gonna lie. I feel like we need more plants. Like I feel like we need another, another one over here. I just like, I, I love plants. I can't get enough of them. Oh wait, this is cute. Maybe up here. 
I'm liking that. I'm liking that. I feel like the time should be in the kitchen, but maybe I want a little herbal snack when I'm doing my makeup. Okay, I was looking at this earlier. I didn't think it was right for the bedside table, but maybe this could be good for in between the bean bags, especially because it's on wheels. Like this is the chill, the chill corner. Maybe things move, you know, because we're chilling so hard. We want, we might want to move things around when we're chilling. So you know, bean bags are movable. The table's movable. We're just chilling so hard. We might want to move it around. You know, we definitely need like a lamp or something. Oh, should we do a moon? <gasps> That's kind of cool. Wow, it's definitely chill too. Wow. <gasps> that is kind of cool. Oh my God. I'm Wait, I'm loving this so far. I'm really loving this. You just do like these types of candles maybe. Oh, they have pink ones. Whoa. The wax is just gonna melt all over <laughs> the dresser, but you know what? That's really not my problem to be quite honest. It could also light the plant on fire, but that's also not something that I'm worrying about right now. Okay, wait, I'm really liking how this is coming together, genuinely. I think it looks cute. We could maybe use some type of artwork on the wall or something over here. Like there's definitely a big blank space over there. Do these come in pink? Whoa, cyber painting. Wow. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa. Wait, whoa. Wow. 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 And you know what? It makes sense too because it's like, it's like artwork of our city, you know? The city that we're living in in this virtual game because we just walk right outside, which, whoa, I left the front door open, I guess. Here's the city. Should we put this in the room? Like, sometimes when you wake up, you're feeling like really down about yourself, you know, because you, you just woke up. Maybe you're really tired. Maybe you're stressed about the day. And this could be something that would just bring a lot of positive energy. Oh my God, look, and look at that. Look what the buyers just said. Not a bad picture. I can just imagine like I'm getting out of bed here and then I'm stepping over here to do my makeup. I'm like, oh, another day. But then I see this, you're breathtaking. And I just feel like it would give me a lot of motivation. Wait, I'm feeling really good about all the work we've done up here. Okay, it does look better with the lights off though. I will, <laughs> I will, I will say that. <laughs> okay, guys, I'm, I've been dying to find out more about this sauna, okay? Because all of the potential buyers, they always want a sauna in the house. And I've got this room across the street here, which I've got to clear out because all of this stuff just is what came with the house. And we have to clear it out because I would love to turn this room. Oh my God. The your breathtaking poster. <laughs> There's already one in the house. Anyway, um, whoa, wait, this is cool. Hold on. I might move that into the house. We need to add, we're gonna add a sauna in here. I've just been dying to, to see the sauna, to add it to one of my homes. Let's clear this all out. Wait, this is kind of cool though, I'm not gonna lie. This is kind of cool. <gasps> we could put it in the closet. Oh my God, it's like the game room. There is nothing in here. <laughs> I feel like the buyers will like this fun surprise. Okay, they're gonna like this. They're gonna like this. Trust me, you guys, they're gonna like it. Anyway, back to this. Oh my God, okay. Wait, okay, this is sick. We can just turn this whole room into a sauna. Okay, but we have to make it a pink sauna, you guys, because we've gotta stay true to our pink theme. Let's get more of this pastel pink and get to painting these walls. I would genuinely, like I'm not even trolling, I would love a sauna in my house. That actually sounds so nice. Should we make the roof pink too? Like, should we make it a full pink sauna?
<gasps> oh my god, new skill point, finally. I feel like I've been dying to get like a painting upgrade because we paint so much. Okay, let's do paint three walls at the same time. I am dying for this. Wait, all the buyers are hating this. They're hating the full pink room. Oh my God, they don't see the vision. Sauna sand timer. You know what? We do need one of those. You don't want to stay in the sauna for too long, you know? Sauna lamp. Okay, we gotta, we gotta add some lights in here. That is definitely a must. Let's decide what color we're going for for our sauna. Okay, Kayla's gonna run a poll. In the meantime, I'm gonna add this sauna heater filled with charcoal rocks. Ooh, we definitely need a sauna bucket with ladle near the coals. Oh, we could do this sauna heater too. Oh, we've got options here. It is getting hot in here for sure. Whoa, what's this one? Oh my God, there's so many different ways to heat your sauna, you guys. I don't even know which one to pick. Okay, it looks like beach is gonna win, you guys. So let's go ahead and do beach. I'm gonna put these lamps up in the corner. Oh, did you see that, by the way? That was kind of crazy. The way it just flipped around. What the hell, look at that. Oh, it's kind of spooky. Okay, let's start adding in all the sauna benches now that we've got the color. Yes, yes. Oh, I don't need a sauna? Oh my God, I'm gonna just choose to ignore that. Okay, I'm not liking this heater with the color we picked. I feel like we'll go with the black one. Let's fit in the corner. Perfect. Perfect, perfect. I just can't even, I can't even believe they're saying they don't need a sauna. Like, after all the flips we've done, one, where everyone wanted a sauna, I can't even, I can't even believe it. All right, I'm gonna do two heaters. So it'll get extra, extra hot in here. I mean, damn, is it getting hot in here or is it just me? All right, now that we've got like the wood color, let's change these floors finally because the ones we have now have got to go. We could do this. If we did this, it would like keep the same, keep that same energy that we have in the house. You know what I'm saying? I kind of like it because it looks good with the heaters. Can you stack the chairs? Because I feel like it's not looking that much like a sauna. Like normally it'd be stacked. Oh, here we go. Wait, here we go. Here we go. This is what I'm looking for. Because normally we do something like this, I feel like, in the sauna. Yes. Yes. Here we go. Now this actually looks like a sauna now. Okay, there we go. <gasps> there we go. This looks good. This looks good. I know we have this theme going on here, this cyberpunk theme, but I think we need to break the theme so we can replace the sauna with a sauna door. It's only what's right, honestly. It's only what's right. We just need the full sauna look. There we go. Wow. Wow. Oh, you know what? There is something else we can add. And listen, it doesn't quite make sense because in real life, I don't know how well something like this would survive, but this is just a video game. So we're gonna add a hanging plant, maybe more than one. Okay, it's just a game. It's just a game. You know what? Actually, I want to add the double decker in the corner. Yes. Yes, sir. I feel like heat and humidity is good for some plants. Yeah, you know what? That is true. So maybe the plants in here, they love heat. They love humidity. Okay, you guys. I think we are officially done with this flip, you guys. So I'm going to give the final walkthrough. Wait, use? Hold on. Whoa, wait. This place comes with a, a car? We can use it to go to, back to the office. This is crazy. Okay, sorry, I got a little distracted. So you guys, I think we are officially done with the flip. 
So we're gonna go through one last time. You walk inside and wow, there's just beautiful artwork of someone's ass on the wall here. We've got good vibes only in the living room, a beautiful pink kitchen, a pretty pink bathroom, complete with pink neon lights looking slender and gorgeous in the mirror as always. We walk upstairs into a loft bedroom with a chill area. Television, we've got Netflix on you guys, you already know. We've got our vanity with a little herbal snack along with our bed complete with a poof we can actually sit on and use. Then there's a hidden surprise in the closet, a video game. And since the buyers always ask for a sauna, We've got one of those as well, you guys, just across the street, a beautiful pink sauna, complete with two cold heaters, double decker levels, and dim lighting to set the mood. Honestly, I'm very attached to this flip, you guys. I just feel like it turned out amazing. I honestly, I love it. <laughs> I literally love it. So I don't know what to do. I don't know, should we sell it? Should we sell it and forget about it? Or should we keep it and turn it into our main office? I really, I really do not know. So I'm gonna end this episode here and I want you guys to let me know in the comments what we should do. What should we do next? Please help guide me in my financial decisions. Either way, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you next time. Bye YouTube.